So what is the secret ingredient that allows unimpeded flow between the strategic agenda and the emotional agenda that we saw on our butterfly? It's actually the behaviours, of course, what we see coming out of the top of our volcano. But it's not just any behaviours, it's what we call the eight value building behaviours. So what are they? I'm going to just give you the list now and then we'll go through them in detail. Active listening. Truly trying to understand what the other person is sharing with you. Asking open questions. Trying to get underneath the surface of what the person is sharing. Summarising to make sure that we have a common understanding of what's been said. Support, so that the other person really feels valued in what they're sharing. Challenge, to make sure that we're helping the other person to truly develop the best ideas and overcome the challenges that they face. Clarifying and contracting, really making sure that we are committed to delivering whatever output we've agreed to. Time out, which enables each of us to play catch up or to change the energy in a room or a meeting when things get difficult. And finally, and essentially, we've got review and feedback. If we're not continuously seeking feedback around our own actions, around our own communication and the communication of others, then how can we hope to improve?